Hi, everybody. This is Dr. Adarsh Gupta. And this presentation, we will focus on what is a healthy weight. In fact, uh, when we talk about weight, uh, we need to understand the weight is not just your BMI. Weight is not the number on the scale, but it's slightly more than that. And once you fully understand what is your weight or what is weight, you'll have a better understanding when we try to lose weight, what is the body component we need to focus on? What is it that we really need to focus on? And uh, so let's get started. Uh, before we do that, let's, it is a little disclaimer. Now let's go on to the weight. So when we go on a weight, on a weight scale, uh, we get a number. And this number we call our weight. Weight is just an, another word for force of gravity. Weight is a force that always acts on all objects near Earth. The Earth pulls on the object with a force of gravity downwards toward the center of the Earth. And this is unique to each planet. If you go on Jupiter, the weight's going to be five, six times higher. If you are on the moon, the moon has a much less gravity, you will be much lighter. So this weight that you see on the scale will change based on where you are. So it's not an absolute number, it's relative, All right? So it's important to understand this part that weight is just a number uh, and it is dependent upon the force of gravity and your mass. Weight is equal to mass times acceleration of gravity. Don't worry about the whole physics. Just focus on the weight is dependent on the mass. And what is mass? In our case, mass is our body. Our body consists of multiple things. Our body is not just fat. It is composed of three main components. Lean body mass, body fat mass, and total body water. A lean body mass is composed of muscle mass, and minerals. We also use another term called fat-free mass. Fat-free mass uh, is just a sum total of lean body mass and total body water. And lean body mass is muscle and minerals. Many times, many times, the body composition can also be differentiated as body fat mass and fat-free mass. Fat-free mass consists of everything that is not fat, such as lean body mass, total body water. I want you all to understand that majority of our body consists of water, then fat, and muscle. And weight does not differentiate if you have muscle weight, or fat weight, or water weight. So if you lose weight, you could be losing muscle, fat, or water. If you lose water, either by drinking caffeine or taking water pills, you will lose weight, but that is not a healthy weight loss. Losing water will greatly impact your health. You should try to maintain at least 60% body water. If you lose muscle, you will also lose weight, but that will slow down your metabolism. It will slow down your basal metabolic rate, which is a measure of number of calories you burn when resting. That is when you do nothing. And that is your metabolism. This will make it difficult for you to maintain the lost weight. If you lose fat, you will lose weight. But when you lose only fat, you improve your health. Your fat releases adipokines. There are small chemicals that start the cascade of chemical reactions in the body that ultimately lead to inflammation and causes metabolic disorders such as diabetes, high blood pressure, high cholesterol. So losing fat stops that. The best combination of weight loss is when you lose fat and gain muscle. Well, in that scenario, your mass your body weight the earth pulling you down mass may not change that means the weight may not change on the scale but you will lose inches of your waist you will look fit and skinnier 
you will feel more energetic and have much higher metabolism. So that kind of weight loss is what we are aiming for. So what is your real weight? Your real weight is just some total of how much muscle fat and water you have and how the earth is pulling you down. So when you lose muscle and water, you do see the scale going down because you lost the mass. But that kind of body composition loss, it's not healthy. As you can see in the very first sheet that I showed you, I'm gonna go back to that, my very first title. You see the picture over here on the right? The person on the left, person on the right, this person on the right and person on the left, by the way, they both have same height, six foot, same weight, 250 pounds, and same BMI. And that's true. You may wonder why. The reason being is the one on the left side, the one with more muscles, has a much higher muscle to fat ratio. That means he has more muscle than fat. So in terms of body composition, he has less person body fat. And because of that, he looks fit, he looks skinnier, he has much higher metabolism, and he will find it easier to maintain that weight. As opposed to person on the right, who also has the same amount of weight, but has higher fat percentage than muscle. So when we're trying to lose weight, we want to make sure we lose fat, not muscle or water. At our weight loss program in Valley Forge Weight Management Center, we do focus on this particular component. We really emphasize body composition. We measure that at every visit and we let, uh, we track it. In fact, we track that. And if you are losing muscle and water, we make changes in your regimen, exercise, eating in such a way so we can come to um, favorable weight loss, that is, we're losing only fat. So that is what the important part you have to learn from this lecture, is learn what is healthy weight is. Of course, it's based on the BMI, uh, but more important than that is how much fat you have in the body. So if you look at the guy, he has a BMI of 33. So from BMI point of view, this person is obese, but he's all muscular. Are you gonna tell him to lose weight? I don't think so. Because this guy has more muscle. There is no need to lose muscle. What you need to lose is fat. So if you gain muscle and lose fat, that's even better. It will boost your metabolism. Energy level is gonna be much higher. Joint stability is gonna be there. You have less joint pain going forward. So there's a lot more benefit. So when we're trying to lose weight, make sure we focus on this part. All right. So with that, uh, this presentation is over and please feel free to write any questions you have, send me an email, you reach us to us at our website, valleyforgedebriams.com and you can do an online chat with us or call us. Thank you.